Just beer reviews, Roche's Real Bitter. Roche's Real Bitter, now this is an old Tooth & Co brand, I have reviewed the Pilsner and the Draft which was a heritage beer. Comes at a 4% ABV, I got this from a Bottle Mart Bottolo, uh, paid about I don't know, around $3 or something for it. So it's really only a mid strength beer being 4%. So anyway, let's crack her open. We're still going to use this uh, Foster's Pills glass. Right up. So that's the colour there. It's a uh, medium golden appearance. Uh, two finger of uh, white soapy head. Uh, on the smell. Yeah, you got some uh, got some adjunct with some uh, maybe some grassy hops there. Yeah. Anyway, let's get into it. Cheers. Very watery mouthfeel to it. Light, watery. Um, uh, you're getting that little wet cardboard, a couple United beers, a uh, little bit of bitterness, a bit of Pride Ringwood there, a bit of flavour, but a um, bit of a dry finish. Yeah, light sweetness from the malt. It actually tastes pretty watered down, being 4%. Uh, that's what I'm getting here. Very watered down brew. Just it starts off okay, but then it just falls away. It just falls into nothing. It's just a real plain beer. I'm surprised they're still making this beer. I thought it would have been made redundant years ago, but it's still going. Let's pull a bit more in there. Right, a quick roundup of this beer. Um, it's definitely nothing special. I wouldn't pay forty bucks a carton for it. I'd stay well clear. It, you can drink it; isn't it fancy? But it's pretty much garbage if you're paying forty bucks a carton for it. Rubbish, absolute rubbish. So this beer, I'm gonna get this a D minus. Um, might have some more drinkers out there, but I tell you what, there's a lot better beers, as I always say, and uh, you can do better than this beer. So a D minus for Rush's Real Bitter. Okay, thank you for watching this episode of Jersey Reviews. Till next time, take care and I'll see you all later.